If you lift your heart, you can sit or stand as you go on with this. Just work at your own pace. So three breaths from your belly and in and out through your nose. Relax your shoulders and your jaw. Perfect. Fantastic. Alrighty. Let's go with this. Warm up. We'll start the rolling march here again. Hands um, out front. Fingertips up and down. It's nice and easy. Warm up some wrist joints. Some fingers. Just wiggle your fingers out front. Nice. Roll your wrists. Try and stay with that, uh, those belly breaths all the way through this and in and out through your nose. Change direction. Nice. Fantastic. Just bring your arms down, let your shoulders come back. Take a look over to one side. Glance in behind with your eyes. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. Your head back to center easy. Don't rush any of this stuff. Work at your own pace, right? Other side. Glance in behind with your eyes. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. And your head back to center. Nice. Chin to chest. Excellent. Look towards your chin. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. And your head back up to center. One more. Chin up. Gentle stretch on your neck and look up. Excellent. Bring your eyes back in line with your head again. And your head back to center. Shoulders. Roll those shoulders. Excellent. Music sounds pretty serious. <laughs> Change direction. Excellent. And bring your shoulders down to a rest. Right, shake that out. Nice. I'm going to move our way down a little bit here. Toe tap. Add some bicep curls. And again, just nice and easy. Just wake up joints. Some fluid flowing. A little hip twist in. So bring your knee in. Again, nice and easy. And definitely, you can hold your chair if you need to for this. Do what you need to do, right? Hip twist out. Excellent. Back to your toe tap straight down. Perfect. And bring those arms down again. Back into your rolling march. Nice. Just watch what's around you. Bring your arms up. Fingertips up. Tilt your arms. Keep your torso straight. Breathe. Excellent. And back to center again. And the other side, when you're ready. Excellent. Back to center again. Straighten your fingers, just wiggle your fingers out here. And get you to make a fist and flick. Fist, flick, that's the ticket. We're just gonna do a few of these. Four, three, two, one, fantastic. Just bring your arms back down again, nice and easy. Shake your arms as you need to. Nice. Perfect. Shoulders, what else do we need to cover here? I'm gonna do some more bicep curls here. So just tuck your elbows in. Bring your hands wider, down low. No fist, 
palms open. Excellent. Bring your arms up and back down again. Okay. Try and keep your arms away from your body. Well, elbows in, but palms away from your body. Again, just be gentle with this. You'll notice different sensations in your shoulders, your biceps. The difference okay. <laughs> it's not bad at all. Excellent. Just one more here. Perfect. Bring those arms down again and let them come back in. Again, do what you need to do. Alrighty. Anything else I want to cover here? I think that's good. So we're going to continue on. So come up into a march. Add your arms. Heart lifted. Basically, it's head over heart and your heart over your hips. And that's what they try and talk about for posture. Excellent. Nice. Just a little bit more marching here. Get things going. Coordinate it up. Excellent. So heels to the front. Keep your arms the same. Push that heel down to the floor. Excellent. Relax your fists. Keep them soft, at least at the moment. Excellent. Extend those arms out like you're walking. Fantastic. We're going to change this heel to the front to a toe tap to the back. So similar to your cross country ski move we do. Excellent. Breathe. Let your arms go. Nice. Back into your march again. I'll get you to bring your feet apart. Pull back with your hands. Reach, pull. So from the side. Excellent. Three more. Two. One, excellent, bring those arms down. Let's wiggle your fingers again. Nice. We're gonna do a side jack. As you lean in, lift your arm. Excellent. Perfect, bring that arm down, grab your hands in behind, and add a little dip here in the middle. Dip. Perfect. Come back to that toe tap again. Let go of your hands. Nice, easy breaths in and out through your nose. Excellent. So we're going to reach across and up. Apple picking. Nice, even breaths. Stay with those breaths. Back across your chest again. Push. Push. Yes. Excellent. And tiny rotation here. So 
opposite hand to opposite side. Try and keep your hips forward and your upper body's doing the little bit of a twist. Excellent. Perfect. Bring your arms back, feet back together. We're going to do a step tap here. Hands are going to go in the front and the back. Perfect, and back into your march again. Nice. And again, you always work at your own pace, right? No matter what I say, let your body rule you. Okay. I mean, within limits. Have a sip of water. Try and keep your body moving while you're taking those little breaks. That blood pumping. All right, I'm gonna get you to tighten up these fists. Stay with the march. Okay. We're gonna do uh, like a punching bag. So about face level, away from your face. Like you're punching, that's it. Rolling punch. And again, heart lifted. Head over your shoulders, shoulders over your hips. Nice. I'm gonna change direction here, around the other way. Again, find your speed. Excellent. Three, two, one, nice, slow that down, release your arms, wiggle your fingers, so your arms kind of hang here for a minute. Your best sloppy march. Nice. Let's do some toe taps to the front. The shoulders come back for us. Toe taps, hands are gonna push forward. Excellent. We're going to toe tap out to the side. Hands are going to follow. Nice. Toe tap into the back. Feet will follow. Hands are still facing forward. Nice. Hands and feet out to the side. Excellent. And then toe taps to the front. Hands are going to follow. Perfect. Excellent. Back into your march again. So stay with those soft fists. You don't want them tight, at least not at the moment. I'm going to do some knee ups and some hamstring curls. We'll start with the hamstring curls this time. The hands are going to come down and you're going to push back and you're going to bring your heels up to your hips. Again, be aware of your posture. If you need to hold on, do that. Build that strength up first. Excellent. I'm going to change to knee ups. Keep your hands the same. Bring your knees up. Excellent. And change your hands. Keep your knees the same this time. Push down. Fantastic. Three, two, 
three, two, and one. Nice, and back into your march again. Soft fists. Perfect. Let's go for some uh, narrow and wide. Okay, so a four count for each. I'm gonna start with narrow. Makes the most sense, right? And your hands are just in that marching position. Okay, four, three, two, one, wide, three, two, one, and narrow, three, two, one, and wide, three, two, one, narrow, three, two, one, and wide, three, two, one, and narrow, three, two, one, wide, two, one, narrow, two, one, wide, two, one, narrow, and we're going to stay right here. Fantastic. Nice. Stay with your march. Now, if that march gets to be too much, change to the rolling march where you're just lifting your heels. Okay. Watch what's around you. Bring your arms out to your side. Flip your palms up. So we're going to follow the beat. So you know it's the same routine. Fingertips together, shoulders, and elbows out front, shoulders open and away. So we're just going to follow the beat after this one. <laughs> Narrow out front, shoulders open and away. So shoulders elbows out shoulders open and away open and away i know it's a lot of movement do your best even if you're catching two of them perfect open and away shoulders elbows out shoulders open one more. Open and away. Flip your palms, fingertips to your ribs, and away. Your ribs, and out. Your ribs, one more. Your ribs, excellent. And out, and just bring your arms down nice and easy. Let your shoulders relax. For water if you like. I'm going to try and keep something moving. Even if the one foot. Fantastic. So just more a few more minutes in this cardio section, and then we'll move on. So let's see, what we'll finish off with. Trying to get forward backwards. So so lift your toe as you go back, lift your heel as you go forward. Toe, heel, excellent. Perfect. All right. So hands, as you go move forward, you know, push your arms out. Push, push. And again, if you're holding on or you're behind your chair, just using one arm, you're adapting to it. That's all you need to do. Push, push, push. Excellent. Two and one. Excellent. Bring those arms back in. Change leading legs. Same thing again. Heel, toe. Make sure one foot's always planted. We're gonna do that same thing again, all right? As you go forward, you're gonna push, okay? Push, 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 push.
Excellent. Three, two, one. Fantastic. All right. Stay here. This time, we're going to pull back. Okay? So as you lean back, you're going to pull as if you're pulling an uh, oar. Pull, pull, and that's it. Pull, pull, excellent. Three, two, one. Fantastic. Bring your arms down. Switch leading legs again. When we do on one side, you make sure you do on the other. Keep your body equal, both sides, Not as best you can, right? So the last one here is the pullback. Okay. Get into that rhythm, and when you're ready, you know, pull back as you lean back. Pull, pull, pull. Excellent. Three, two, one. Fantastic. Bring those arms down into your march again. You're going to let your arms relax here. Perfect. Take a breath. Take two. Nice. So add your arms here. Perfect. Just check your posture. Your head over your heart. Heart over your hips. So we're going to change back. We're going to go into our cool down. With any luck, I got your blood pumping a little bit or more. So toe tap straight down. Excellent. Nice, easy breath. Slow that breathing down a little bit. Nice. A little hip twist in here. Hip twist out. Excellent. And into that rolling march. So just lift your heels, let your arms drop here. Nice. So on your inhale, you're gonna bring your shoulders up. And as you exhale, lower them back down. Nice. So just nice and easy. Follow your breath. No number you need to meet here. The idea is just to slow your blood circulation down a little bit. Also helps you get in tune with your body, right? Lifting your shoulders up as you inhale and then lowering them as you exhale. one more. Excellent. So your shoulders relax. Your breathing also. I'm going to get you to follow your breathing for this second one too. So the second part of that shoulder workout. So you want to bring your shoulders together in the front. So even just rolling your arms. Excellent. As you exhale and as you inhale, roll them the other way. Just touch your shoulder blades in the back. Exhale, inhale, try and work from your belly as you breathe. I know when you open up, it's easy to use your chest to breathe. Excellent. I'm going to do one more here. Fantastic. Just let your shoulders come back. Staying with that nice, easy rolling march. Again, head over your heart, heart over your hips. 
and drop an ear over his shoulder. Let your jaw relax and your shoulders. Fantastic. Gently bring your head back up to center. And once your neck allows, drop your ear to the other side. Excellent. And again, gently back up to center. Let your head come back. Shoulders, neck. Nice. Perfect. Um, what else we need to do here? A little more rolling in the wrist. I don't think you need it, but we'll do that anyways. Keep it low. And change direction. Wiggle your fingers. Perfect. Let your arms drop. Shake that out again. So we're going to continue on. Let's go to weights. I'm going to stand for weights, but again, you can sit if you choose. Choose wisely. Have a sip of water. And even if you're not using weights, get you to kind of participate. Nice. And once you're ready, whether you're seated or standing, make sure your feet are flat on the floor. Okay. And again, you want your heart lifted. All right. Excellent. Be sure to tighten your core as we go through these. This is a good core workout, so you want to kind of make sure that everything's all locked and loaded as it were. Okay. So soft knees, if you're seated, it doesn't apply to you. Okay. We'll start with um, a bicep curl, one at a time. Okay. Although we'll alternate side to side. Okay. Tuck your elbows in, one arm up, back down, and then switch sides. Excellent. And do uh, 10 repetitions of all of these particular ones. And again, you work at your own pace. Some belly breaths and in and out through your nose if you can. And we'll slow it down just a little bit here. I'm kind of racing. We don't need to do that. Core strong. Excellent. And we're down to four. Three. And one. Fantastic. Excellent. Your arms back in. Nice. A lateral lift. So off to the side. Again, we're going to alternate side to side, one arm at a time. All right. So check your posture, knees, everything's all in line and ready to go. Core is uh, tight, you're tensing your core a bit. Arm up and down, nice and easy, and the same on the other side. Exhale to bring your arm up if you choose. Inhale back down, give you a good pace.
six. Five, check your knees, make sure they're not locked. Four. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. Bring those arms back down. Sweet. Perfect. Let's go with uh, press. Press back. So again, arms, everything's all in line as best you can do. Exhale to push your arms back. Inhale back to center. Okay. Nine. Eight. Tighten that core. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, and one. Excellent, fantastic. Bring your arms in. I'm gonna get you to step forward with your right leg. Okay. Sink down into it just a little bit. I'm gonna tilt your hips, and sit your hips back, but keep your back flat. Arms are down low. And you're not going all the way down. We're staying at a good position here. Everything is locked and in good form, right? Uh, you want to make sure you're balanced between your front and your back foot. Okay? We're just going to do it's called pants up. Just pull your arms in, and your elbows and arms or everything is all tucked into your body. Okay? Excellent. I'm making these chicken wings as you lift up. Excellent. So back is flat and your head's the extension of that. So you want to make sure your head's not down or way too far up. Okay, nice in line with your back. Perfect. Fantastic job. Down to our last four, three, two, and one. Excellent. Let's bring yourself back up. Straighten your legs. Nice. Now I want to try and match something up for the other side, and again. Just a little bit different. So left foot forward this time. Back up a little bit. Left foot forward, right foot back. And again, you want to kind of bend your knees. Okay. This distance doesn't matter. It's whatever is comfortable for you. Okay. You want to just set your hips back and again, flatten your back. This one's a little bit harder. Again, work at your own pace. Okay, so if 10 is going to be too much, do your number and then just come out of it. All right. So, Bring your elbows up, hands and everything are all tucked in, okay? Your elbows are going to stay where they are, and you're going to straighten your arms. Keep those elbows high, excellent. Be gentle with this, and again, do what you can, and then once you're done, or once your arms or muscles are done, just come right out of it, all right? Breathe. Exhale. Exhale. 
exhale. You feel your muscles working if you're using weights. Exhale. Take breaks if you need to. Excellent. Try and keep your head in line with your body, your back rather. Exhale. Keep those elbows up. Two more. Excellent. Arms in, bring yourself up, arms down. Fantastic. That's a good one. I'm going to get you to have a seat. And we will do a couple more seated here. I want to do that uh, ankle workout here, or calf raise, whatever you want to call it. Putting your weights on your legs is optional. You don't have to do that. Follow through with the exercise anyways, okay? So bring that heel up and slowly lower it back down, okay? Nice and smooth. Nice, easy breaths. Excellent. We're halfway. Three, two, and one. Excellent. Switch legs. Exact same thing again. Heel up. Find that you want that knee over the ankle. I, I didn't mention it last time. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, and one. Excellent. Fantastic. Well done with the weights, by the way. You're going to roll them off to the side. With any luck out of your way. And that will do. Have a sip of water. You stay seated. Do some more seated strength stuff here. So when you're ready, join right in, okay? Let's do um, double-legged toe drag, okay? So we're gonna use the little steps. There's feet out front, lift your heels, drag them both back, hold your chair if you need to, and then tiny steps out, lift your heels and drag back, okay? Tiny steps, lift your heels, Halfway. And three. Two. And one. Excellent. Bring your feet back out front. Nice. Well done. Do our. Uh, Seated crunch, I'm gonna get you just to cross over, hands on your shoulders. So hinging from your hips, I'm gonna tilt forward. As far as you go is perfect. You don't have to go all the way down, wherever your hips allow, right? Inhale back, touch your back if you can, 
Excellent, and then exhale forward again. Exhale forward. Feel your tummy tighten up as you tilt forward. You might a little bit. Excellent. Four more. Three. Two. And one. Just touch your back. Just come off that chair a little bit. We're going to hover here for four, three, two, one, and all the way up. Perfect. Fantastic. Bring your arms down. Shake that out. some uh, again about the middle of your chair and do some big steps over to one side again you're stepping over your favorite size of dog you get to choose and over to one side and back to center line yourself up again and then the other side and back to center to the side again back to center nice last time excellent and back to center nice so slowly slide yourself back on your chair keep your feet flat on the floor okay so if you want that's your priority keep your feet flat on the floor slide back as far as you can while still keeping your feet flat on the floor okay find that spot that's your start and end point for seated or um, we're going to do um, uh, not squats seat sit stand okay and make sure that your feet are always flat on the floor and push your weight into your feet the whole foot not just the toes and not just the heels excellent inhale up Excellent. Exhale all the way back down. Nice and easy. Perfect. Yeah. Again, I'm going to do 10 repetitions here. You do what works for you today. Perfect. Keep your breathing. Yeah. Inhale up. Exhale back down. Fantastic. Halfway. Three, two, and one. Excellent. Come all the way down. Perfect. Fantastic. All right, we're going to do some balance. 
I'm gonna get you to come in beside your chair to start. So again, if you want, you can have a sip of water here. We'll start on one side of your chair. Excellent. All right. Bring your feet together and get your chair for to start, right? Outside leg, you're gonna straighten that leg, lift your toe, set your heel down if you need to. Otherwise, lift that leg up. Once it's up, test your balance. Excellent. And back down the chair and bring that leg back in. Nice. Keep your feet together. I'm gonna go to the side this time. Again, start by holding on. Lift your toe, straighten that leg and bring it out to the side. Bring that toe in a little bit. That's it, in towards your body. Test your balance. Excellent. Hand back on the chair and bring that leg back in. Nice. If you're ready. You're gonna to go to the back, again, on the same leg, all right? Start by holding, lift your toe, straighten your leg, send your leg back. Nice, test your balance. Make sure you keep your heart lifted. Hand back on the chair. Bring that leg back in. Shake it out. Perfect. Nice. We're going to switch weight bearing legs. So when this leg is ready, <laughs> the other leg you're going to bicycle. Okay? And again, start by holding. Add that outside arm. Big arm movements this time. Test your balance. And if you're not using that low arm, bring them both in. Excellent. Change direction. Breathe. Nice. Set that leg down. Well done. Shake that out. Perfect. Just come in, in behind your chair. We're gonna do some uh, pop-ups. Again, keep your feet fairly close together, okay? parallel if you can. Pop up quick, and then slowly lower back down. So pop up, and then down. Nice. Three more. Two, keep breathing, one, excellent, and heels to the floor, yes. other side of your chair, we're going to repeat what we did there, so inside legs weight bearing, outside is going to be the fancy movement leg, hand on your chair, outside leg, straighten the leg, lift your toe, bring that foot either heel down or all the way up, balance, breathe, nice, bring that leg back in, nice and easy, perfect, again start, hand on your chair, you go to the side this time, lift your toe, and then that leg up, make sure your toe is in, turned in, again if this is too much, bring that toe down to the floor, balance. Nice. Bring that leg back in, hand on the chair. Perfect. And again, when you're ready. Okay. I'm going to go to the back this time. Outside leg, lift your toe, straighten your leg, send it back. Test your balance if you choose. Nice. Your toe is down on the floor if it's too much. Excellent. And lift your toe and bring that foot back. Nice. Well done. Hand back on your chair again. Outside leg is going to be weight bearing. Inside, you're going to bicycle. So, inside leg, outside arm. 
big movements today. Big, big, big. And again, if you're not using that for balance, then add that second arm. Fantastic. Change direction. Nice. Perfect. Bring that foot down. Nice. Excellent. Just let your hips come back. Well done. Well done. In behind your chair again. Do some stretches. I know this class went by quick. Hands on your chair. One leg back. Find a nice stretch. You're going to lean into it today. Okay, so knee over your ankle. Back leg, plant that heel. And then straight line from your heel to the crown of your head. Straight-ish line. Three breaths. In and out through your nose and from your belly. Fantastic. Long leg, bend the knee. Keep those heels planted. Excellent. Straighten your legs. Take a step. Other leg's going to be the exact same thing. Plant your heel, find a really good spot there. Nice stretch. Three breaths. Fantastic. Bend that straight leg. Excellent. Try and keep that heel planted. Straighten your legs, take a step. Well done. Stay behind your chair. Get you to bring your feet apart. Okay. Hands out to the side, reach for the walls, spread your fingers. Nice. Drop your right arm, left arm across your chest. That right arm is going to come up. Hug that. Arm right into your chest, right into you. Give that left arm and shoulder a nice hug. Excellent. Fingers, drop those fingers down, supporting arm. Arm back out to the side. Okay. Up this time, grab your collar. Nice. Other arm's gonna come down around like a belt. Fantastic. Stay with your belly breath. Excellent. Bring those arms out to the side. Nice and easy. Perfect. And you're just going to drop that left arm this time and that right arm is going to come across your body left arm up and hug the right arm into your body this time let that hand relax breathe perfect supporting arm drop it down bring that right arm out it's going to come up Grab your collar, left arm in behind. Three breaths. Excellent. Bring those arms out again. And gently lower them down. Perfect. Fantastic. Let's do one for the neck. 
only because we can. So just relax your shoulders, let your arms hang. Again, you're gonna drop an ear to a shoulder. Bring that opposite arm out. You just point the fingers down towards the floor. Excellent. Relax your arm, bring your head back up. Perfect. Other side when you're ready. Drop an ear to a shoulder. And then opposite arm. Point the fingers down towards the floor. Nice easy breath. Excellent. Release that arm and bring your head back up to center. Yes. Perfect. We're going to drop a chin to a chest here too, only because we'll finish this off. Nice easy breaths here. Excellent. Gently bring your head back up to center. One more chin up. Gentle stretch on your neck. Excellent. And back to center again. Nice. Perfect. Come into a squat. Cross your arms. Inhale up. Exhale back down. Fantastic. And bring those arms down. Well done. Excellent. 